What's up guys, it's your boys Awoke you back here with another scary, crazy, all-around paranormal video. And today's video is from the man himself, Nukes Top 5. Thankfully, it finally dropped. We don't have to wait any longer. But today's video is going to be top five scary ghost videos for horrible nightmares. I mean, literally all these videos that we've been watching lately just want to mess with our sleep, our nightmares, our dreams, or whatever have you. None of us are going to get any sleep, so that's why I got my energy drink to watch Nukes Top 5. So grab a chair, guys, some popcorn, and your drink that you might have, and let's get ready to watch Nukes Top 5 right here, right now. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe down below by hitting that red bar icon down at the bottom right. Turn notifications by hitting that bell icon next to it. So I do post videos like this one. You're going to get that little ring notification that Smokey myself has posted that video. And then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, I say this on every video because I give thanks to you guys for making this channel grow and succeed. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep doing what you guys are doing. Tell your friends and your family about Channel Zawoki and the 2022 will be even better than the rest but with that being said also check out the link in the description for nukes top five go over to his channel do the thing subscribe comment like and share give him the love that he deserves for putting this together for us and enjoying and getting scared and now without further ado let's get in the top five scary good for ghost videos that will horribly give you nightmares let's take a look Oh, and I love the sounds of Nukes Top 5. Top 5 ghosts caught on camera. Yes, please. Lady in the water. No, please. Debbie Morales and her friends are tubing down the canals of the Isabella River in Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. She begins to record with her phone. Debbie can be heard screaming and laughing until her camera catches something in the water that quickly makes her lose her voice. What is that? Could that be a trick Debbie of the light? the video to Facebook saying that she saw a scary apparition in the water. She asked friends to take a look and see if they saw the same thing in the video. Oh, I got chills. And they did. Online viewers speculated that the image could be anything from the ghost of a drowning victim to a body in the water. That's not and a body. Some even went so far as to suggest that it might be a... Mermaid. I don't know about mermaid. Now the most bizarre part of this video is that whatever this is almost seems to lunge toward Debbie before disappearing back into the water. But what do you think? I don't know. Is this just a strange trick of the light or a reflection? Or did Debbie catch something supernatural on camera? But it looks like it's got hair you and decide. a body. Oh my gosh. Alexander seems to be sleepwalking and speaking gibberish when something hanging next to the door starts swinging around on its own and an empty water jug slides right across the floor. I normally don't do that. Alexander opens the door, walks outside, and suddenly screams. He says he has no recollection of what happened to him and has no idea why he screamed. Now, Alexander says he's experienced supernatural activity before, 
so he begins to suspect that he might have seen something paranormal while sleepwalking. Oh, I put a body then, camera on him. Only a day later, this happens. Put a little GoPro on his chest. Shiznits! Holy hell. The son of a biscuit moment the right there. moves on its own. The fridge door opens, and what appears to be a pack of plastic spoons is launched off the kitchen counter. Why the spoons? Over the next few months, uh, nothing much happens. But then late one night, Alexander is hanging out at his friend Adam's house when he sees something truly chilling. Oh, a mother of crappy! That's very creepy. She doesn't live there? When I arrive, she's gone. A strange looking woman wearing a red dress appears to be watching Alexander from the building across the street. Alexander claims that when his friend Adam finally came over to see what was going on, the creepy woman I have chills. had disappeared. My arm is goosebumped. While there, Adam asks Alexander to take a look at a speaker that's been acting up and might be broken. Alexander is still recording and captures something terrifying. Okay, that girl's gone. The button on the top, press it. Press the one in the middle. Ah, it's behind you! Did you see it? In the, in the reflection of the window, the same woman in red can suddenly be seen standing behind Alexander in the doorway. When he pans around, the woman has moved in an instant and is now standing right next to him. What the f Who biscuit? or what could this eerie looking figure be? Could it be a spirit that attached itself to the sleepwalking TikTok user? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? If it's a hoax, you decide. <laughs> this next creepy video went viral on TikTok. Oh my gosh. And it was originally recorded by Indonesian Twitter user Gusta Dang. Gus explains on Twitter that he was flying from Surabaya, Indonesia to Bali and that he was the very first passenger to board the empty plane. As Gus is boarding, he records a video to send back to his wife. When he looks back at his footage, he spots something truly chilling. On a plane? Oh, 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 oh. There's nobody in that damn seat. Someone or something that seems to be cloaked in black can be seen moving around in one of the seats. But when Goose walks by the seat, there's no one there. Gusta Dang's video has been watched over 14 million times, and many viewers believe that the strange figure in the video could be the spirit of a deceased passenger. But what do you think? I don't know. Take that user Jim works at oh. what he believes to be a haunted hospital in New Jersey. Early These are one good. afternoon, a security camera in one of the hospital's hallways captures something very creepy during Jim's shift. What is it again? Well, you know, One moment. <laughs> Bro, that girl's like a supply what car the hell? can be seen rolling down the hallway on its own, freaking out the hospital staff nearby. Jim and his co-workers have no idea what could have moved the cart, but things are about to get even stranger. Another CCTV camera in the hospital's laundry room records something absolutely unnerving. Record it from here. Oh no, stepbrother, I'm stuck in the washer dryer. Oh, what the heck is it moving like that for? Oh, thank you. <laughs> no way. Oh, th no way. First of all, there's no way to put this on a string and move these. These are probably heavy as hell. How is it? What? Jim. Send me the video when you. Oh, I'm gonna. The best is when the other one comes over. It's like it, it didn't want to see the front of it. You know, it's yeah. funded so that he doesn't have to look at it no more. Whoever's in their room. 
What the hell? Oh the other one's doing it. Madeline, you didn't see. Come and look at the second one. Here comes the second one. No, the second one's moving now. No way. That's a strong ghost. He's not been. He's not been skipping arm day. Watch the second. Any second. It happens. Look, here goes. It happens. Look. This does not happen. Look. This doesn't happen. Look. Look at it. Who's spinning it? It's spinning. It's spinning the cycle. It's got to be spinning. No There's way. no way it's that There's no way that. I don't care if it's bolted or not. They're, they're, they don't spin like that. Mine ain't bolted in my house. Mine don't come and walk around my. <laughs> <laughs> Look. No, it don't do that. Look how that one just came out. How'd it come out like that? Mm -mm. That was pushed out. I don't yep. care what nobody says. You can tell me whatever you want. Me too. I can't There's no tell. way that the laundry is <laughs> look, doing that. Where's Keith? Show him the thing. Look here. Look. <gasps> look at this. Look. 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 Oh, it's going to fall. No way. There's a ghost here. No way. I'm showing him the ghost in the back. The ghost? Oh, did you, did you ever see what happened last night? Forgot about it. Somebody open, up the, somebody open up the door. The laundry, all the laundry things in there, yeah. they just start moving. Right they just start coming out and moving and going in circles and what you call it. Play on? Come and look. Yeah. But it's crazy. I never saw anything like it in my whole life. Heavy washers and dryers slide across the floor as if they weigh nothing, seemingly moved by some unseen this force. This is like Hulk's ghost. Jim and his fellow hospital workers can't believe their eyes as they watch the CCTV monitor. Now, even I'm not sure just what's going on here. <laughs> I don't know either. Could it be that the hospital is indeed haunted, like Jim says? Or just what could be spinning around multiple heavy washers all at the same time? Hulk's ghost. Let me know what you think. Move on to the next video. If you see anything that you Hopefully think should someday. be included in the top five, contact us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. The Haunting in Carmel, Maine. Ooh, another good one. Kent Burris has been recording all of the strange supernatural activity going on in his haunted home for many years now and posting his experiences to his YouTube channel, Ghosts of Carmel, Maine. In his latest YouTube docu-series about the house, Kent reveals That's some a funny chilling, window. never before seen footage. <laughs> Saw that. Hell no to the no, no, no. Now lately, Kent believes that the paranormal presence in his home has become much more sinister and aggressive. The haunting has become so extreme that it now seems that the spirits are actually out to hurt Kent. During a spirit box session, Kent captures a chilling message. What? What'd you say? Time to go. What? What'd you say? Did you say murder can't? That's the second time I've heard that. It's like nine times we just I heard. I would have swore a few minutes ago I heard them say kill, kill Kent. And just a second ago I would have swore I heard them say murder Kent. Now, threats are one thing. Yeah. But what happens next is downright terrifying. Oh, I saw you. I saw you in the kit. Oh, it's just okay. What the hell is that noise? Is it the water heater? There is no doubt that if I step down in that water, 
You know, like electric electrocuted. electrocuted. Yeah. The heater motor was in the water, and for some reason, the breaker never tripped. And on top of the fact that that water was splashing all over the breaker panel, I have no doubt. Wow. If I would have stepped down in that water, I would have been dead. And the only thing that saved me was remembering the voices just prior that said, kill Kent, murder Kent. That's what stopped me from stepping down in that water. Look at that over there. That's just weird. Kent's basement suddenly floods and high voltage lines are making contact with the water. Kent is convinced that he could have lost his life if he hadn't been so wary of the ominous threats that he had received earlier. Holy when Kent God. is walking through the main floor of his home, he experiences something that chills him to his core. Oh, oh mother fudger! Mm. Oh my God, what the hell? He's freaking... I don't care if it's snowing, I'm in my house. A shadow figure is standing at the top of the staircase, seemingly waiting for Kent in the darkness. Shocked by the sudden appearance, Kent has had enough for a while and just steps outside and into the cold main snow. Kent's encounters have been widely viewed by his YouTube audience and even privately investigated by paranormal groups. All believe that the house in Carmel, Maine is severely haunted by something sinister. But a lot of people think it's uh, fake. Getting the chance to come in and investigate the Lamb House, it is truly an experience that I will never, ever forget. The amount of activity and interaction is just mind blowing. But what do you think? I think Let it's you know haunted. Down in the comments. But a lot of people think Closet it's not. Space. In this next extremely spooky video from Japan, real estate agents can oh be seen God. giving a tour of an empty apartment to a potential renter. Japanese the ghosts woman are is interested terrible. in renting and says that she is surprised by the low monthly price. Could be somebody died in As it. she tours the apartment, she records a video with her phone to review later. Oh gosh. But when she's all alone in one of the apartment's bedrooms, things take a terrifying turn. Japanese ghosts are terrible. Oh, have mercy. Lovely burners. Girl, just leave. Just leave. Just leave. Does she not hear him? Oh, have mercy. All the suspense. I'll have mercy. Don't turn around fast, please. Don't touch it! Have you seen these movies? <gasps> Don't touch it! Oh, it had her. <laughs> nope, I'm dead. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh, holy shiznits! Holy biscuits of gravy! Oh.
I can't do this! My heart's Warren gonna give out! in fear when two pale hands grab her oh. by the legs. Then as she looks up, a terrifying face can be seen peeking out from oh the top of the gosh. bedroom closet. Now, as with most Japanese videos, the source of this clip is impossible to find. And I have no idea what happened afterwards. Oh my gosh. So is it real? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? If it's a hoax, it's a... You decide. It's a bravo. Well done. Viewer I, I, videos. I don't know this what next video was sent in by a Nukes Top 5 viewer who wishes to remain anonymous. Oh. He explains in his email that he's in the United States military and is stationed at a U.S. military post in Germany. He says that two of his friends were out on a regular patrol checking out a creepy old German chapel. Now, this chapel was controlled by German military forces during the Second World War, oh. and it is said to be extremely haunted. As the two men check out the dark chapel, they are shocked when they start to hear unexplained voices coming through their two-way radios. That's our radios going off in the cage. I don't know if somebody's hot like it or not. There's the ones in the car. They open. It went off. It, it turned off. I've used radios that in the military like that, and it's not supposed to happen. Still recording? Yeah. Turn it out. If you couldn't tell. We were just standing at the, the top of the pews, basically, and our radios just started going off, and there was voices and like a lady whispering in it. I swear to God. Yeah, I heard it. And nobody said hot mic. You because really, the because the desk radio can say hot mic over the, yeah. and it'll it'll Don't cut over it. it. Yeah. And it wasn't us because we would have heard each other talking. That's creepy. That was so sketchy. <laughs> you just send that stuff to Stan, dude. What seems to be the voice of a child can be heard, followed by the inaudible voices of adults. I was like, shut up. No. There's another one. Now the radio channel that they are using is restricted to military communication. Exactly. So the two men have no idea where the voices could be coming from or what they are saying. They wonder if it could possibly be the ghosts of tragic souls that passed away during the Second World War. But what do you think these voices are? I don't know. And just what could they be saying? Let me know what you think. A Nukes Top 5 viewer who wishes to remain anonymous reached out to me about a very spooky situation he found himself in late one night at an abandoned church in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. Ooh. The viewer explains in his email that he works security and is dispatched to investigate buildings where motion-activated alarms have been triggered. That'd be creepy. Late one night, he gets a call that a motion alarm has been triggered on the second floor of a creepy old abandoned church. When he arrives, he sees something suspicious and begins to record. What he captures is truly disturbing. Oh, man. Oh, what is oh, that? What oh! Oh, what the f***? 1022! 1022! I need backup! <laughs> Sw 
squatter, maybe? I don't know. They got canine dogs in there, too. Someone or something small and dark can be seen moving away from the second floor window. Now, prior to this encounter, the security guard says that he had checked all doors into the building and they all were locked tight. Oh, boy. He immediately calls the police to the scene to investigate. But they find no one inside and no there way is that nobody. anyone could have gained entry. The mysterious sighting caught on camera remains a mystery. But of course, let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Oh, it's something. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and be sure Ooh. to hit the notification bell so that you never miss a video. Oh, man. My Instagram is there. My Twitter is there. And, and the TikTok. TikTok. Anyway, hopefully I'll see you back here for the next video. Yes. Another great video by Nukes Top 5. That Japanese one definitely had me on my... I don't know what edge of my seat, whatever have you. I lost it. My heart was pounding. I don't know about you guys. Hopefully, I didn't scare you guys too much on this. But with that being said, of course, comment down below, as usual, about these. If you guys think these are real, fake, fact, fiction, whatever have you. I love reading you guys' comments. I reply to 90% of them unless they get sent to the the hold for review because people like to use vulgar, vulgar language and all that crap and stupidity. And But... Make sure you guys comment down, down below. Like the video because it definitely helps out the channel and analytics and also gets my views out there or my videos out there for you guys to enjoy. And again, subscribe and turn on notifications. We'll see you guys in the next video. Keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep learning on. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.